And as I mentioned in the previous video, she had been using the toilet paper only to fold it up and place it in a pile to reuse. She has also been using sanitary pads as a form of toilet paper as well. I got a lot of comments on the last video from people very concerned about her being able to get toilet paper. And I promise you guys, I am going to load her up with tons of everything she could possibly need from toiletries to cleaning supplies to food and more. Another really common question was why I do this with no help. And I've explained this before in other videos, but I'll go over it really quickly. This is an extremely difficult thing to do mentally and physically to be able to clean up hundreds of pounds of garbage through bugs and fuzzy little guys with their droppings everywhere it isn't the greatest for someone who's not in a good mental state but most importantly is the fact that these situations are normally dangerous and can be toxic so i myself am insured in case anything happens to me or the home while i'm here and i do this for free so i wouldn't expect someone else to pay for themselves to be insured that being said although it's just me i do as much as i can and as many days in a row as needed to make sure the job's always done so after six hours on my first day and a giant pile of garbage bags i managed to get her living room cleared out and i'll be back tomorrow to continue